Welcome to Ithaca College's Homer 9 Connect Advisee Search for Advisors. We're going to go ahead and get started at apps.ithaca.edu. We're going to click on the Homer Connect tab. Once we're in the Homer Connect tab, we're going to click on for faculty advisors. And that's going to bring us to the new faculty services dashboard. Once we arise on the dashboard, I'm going to click Advisee Search. And I have a few options here. I'm going to get started by making sure that the term I want to view is selected. And in this case, I'm going to select Spring 2019. Right now, I would like to see all my advisees, so I'm going to click on View My Advisee Listing. This is a convenient listing that brings up all of your students. I'm going to go ahead and use the scroll bar to scroll across and see some additional information on my students. Also, if I'm interested in emailing all of my students, I can click this icon here. To get some more additional information about our students, I'm going to go ahead and click View Profile. Once I click the View Profile page, I land on the profile for my individual advisee that I chose. From here, I can see some biographical information, general information, their graduation applications, their advisors. I can also see their primary major. If they had a second major, I would be able to see the secondary major, the courses the students registered for, I can go ahead and click Prior Education and Testing, and this is going to show me the high school a student attended, if they attended a post-secondary education institution before coming to Ithaca College, and all of the students' test scores. I can also use these additional links to go out to DegreeWorks, view a student's unofficial transcript, application to graduate, and I can also get to IC Workflow. Please remember, you're only going to have access to this level of detail in a student's record if the student is assigned to you as an advisee. One thing that's great about the new Homer Connect 9 feature is I can use the back button to get back to my advisee search and click on additional students if I want additional information. I'm going to go back to my faculty services dashboard so I can demonstrate other ways to search. I could choose a different term if I wanted. And in this case, I'd like to demo how to search by a student ID. So I'm going to go ahead and input the student's ID and hit Enter. Upon doing that, the student's name appears, and I can click View Profile. Also, if I wanted to search by student name, it's going to let me know here that it's last name before first name. And I'm going to click in the box to start putting in my search. And as I begin to type the name, you'll see that all of the students with this last name will appear in my search box. Again, you will only be able to search for students that you have a tie to the academic record, meaning you would need to be an advisee. And on the class list, which there'll be another tutorial for that, you'll be able to see some of the information on the student profile. If you have any additional questions on how to use this advisee search functionality, please contact the Registrar's Office at registrar.ithaca.edu. We hope that you found this tutorial helpful.